begin by welcoming everyone here today and thanking all of you for being here. It's no accident that every one of you is here today because you are such an incredibly important part of Jonathan and Julie's lives. You've been a part of some of their best and some of their worst days, and you're an irreplaceable part of all their tomorrows. We couldn't be more excited or be more privileged to be here with all of you today to witness two of these lovely people committing to a lifetime of love together. Before we begin, Jonathan and Julie wanted to take a moment to remember those who can't be here with us today. Jonathan's parents, Phil and Anne. Julie's parents, Phil and Betty. And Julie's sister, Linda, who are here with us in spirit and in our hearts. However, if you think you're hearing voices from beyond, you're not. Those are just Jonathan's brothers and sisters joining us from the UK <laughs> via video stream. Oh, I'm going to say hi to Jonathan. Hi, <laughs> Julie and Jonathan have asked that we keep the ceremony short and classy, tall order, I know, um, and to refrain from telling any stories that might cast anyone in an unflattering light. <laughs> <laughs> I'm pausing for laughter. I'm pausing for laughter. <laughs> already all know the stories, but there will be time for roasting and toasting later, and rest assured, there will be roasting and toasting later. But for now, I just wanted to say one thing. There's one thing I feel comfortable saying, and that's what I told you when I first realized how serious the two of you were becoming, and that was, <coughs> I told you so. Yep. These two balance each other out, and while both of them are amazing individuals, together they're even more amazing. And coming together, being better together as a team, a unit, partners in crime, it's been years in the making. Something to do with a long game, but it, no stories till later, got it, got it, but well played, Jonathan, well played. That long game is what brought us all here today to witness these two people making a commitment to each other to love each other for the rest of their lives in front of the people that they love the most in this world. So without further ado, let's say some vows. Julie and Jonathan, you two are about to make promises to each other that you fully intend to keep. You're going to vow to take care of one another, to stand up for one another, and to find happiness in each other. And there's a unifying premise to all of these things. It's that you're promising to show up, to be there. You're teaming up and you're saying, every experience I have in my life, I want you there beside me for all of them. As part of their vows, Jonathan and Julie have chosen to do a hand fasting ceremony in honor of Jonathan's Celtic heritage. They have chosen ribbons and colors that have special meaning to them, and these ribbons will be in their home for the rest of their lives as a memory of today, of their commitment to each other, and all of you being here with them. So, Jonathan and Julie, Bunny ears are fine, whatever you can make out of them. <laughs>
promise to keep Jonathan as your favorite person and never give him up. <laughs> to laugh with him, to go on adventures with him, to support him during life's tough moments, to be proud of him, to grow old with him, and to find new reasons to love him every single day. I do. Do you, Jonathan, promise to keep Julie as your favorite person and to never give her up? To laugh with her? go on adventures with her. Life's toughest moments to be proud of her, to grow old with her, and to find new reasons to love her every single day. I do. As your hands are now bound together, so shall your lives be bound as well. Now who has the rings? <laughs> These rings are special. They enhance who you are as a couple. And your rings are circles, and that's no accident. They symbolize love that never ends. It's the seal of the vows that you are taking today to love each other without end. Julie, please place the ring on Jonathan's left hand and repeat after me. Hang on. We'll get there. <laughs> Yeah, you gotta walk down. You're the first. Woo! 